Hey guys, it's Beano. Welcome back to Final Fantasy VII Blind. In the last part, we uh, went around with the snowy land and we found our way to this place. Now this is a surprise? Uh, you a girl? You're not a girl. No, this is a surprise. I'll give me that kind of voice. <laughs> okay. It's been years since I last saw anyone up here. Oh, I'm sorry. My name's Holzoth. I've lived here for, four, for 20 years. Barrett, your foot's outside the building there. Do you mind hearing some stories from a lonely climber? <laughs> I guess so. Why don't we go to the next room and sit down? Okay. This room? Okay. You ever hear about those who challenge the cliff? Yeah. The first time my friend Namsky and I tried to climb the cliff was 30 years ago. But we weren't prepared for it. We would never dream the temperature would be so low. That cliff has a biting cold wind that lowers your body temperature. Oh my god. Oh god. Yamsky was below me. He cut his own rope. I didn't even notice. Jeez, sad. I've lived here ever since, challenging the cliff and providing warning and shelter to my fellow climbers. If you're gonna climb a cliff, you need to take two precautions. First, check your rope. It's hard to find because of all the snow. Okay, so you do that and you... Raise body temperature? I'm guessing that's something. Second, warm yourselves up once you get to a ledge. Understand? You must be tired coming all the way up here. Better get some rest before you head out. Oh gosh, my throat. Immediately start off the part. Give this one guy the most irritating voice on my on my throat. Ah. Anyway, uh. Jeez, sorry guys. I'm sorry about that. I tell Steam, I tell Steam to offline friends mode and then it'll come up anyway. I don't know. You know, I've been thinking. What is it? <coughs> what is it? Seeing a place like this makes you realize how awesome nature is. But if anyone ever told me to live here, I'll tell them to, well, you know. I'll tell you one thing though. If I did have to live here, I'd change things around and make it better. I guess Midgar is the total opposite of this place. If you think about it that way, Shinra don't seem so bad. Ruh! What the hell am I saying? The Shinra not bad! What's the gear of the road? You come up later. Oh, jeez. Ah, oh, my throat. Alright. This is secret info, but Rufus is going to arrive here too. Ah, oh, change members. What about you, Red 13? What are you going to say? I wonder what's at the top of the cliff. Well, we shall see. What's it have to say? Damn, if I was back in the air, this cliff would be nothing. Okay. Alright, cliff it is. So we gotta figure out how to warm ourselves. It's one of those buttons. Still going up? There we go. 36. Oh. No, that's the menu. So do I. Which button do I press? To heat myself. Oh, I, can, I guess I can't do it while climbing. So I'm up here. Don't hit X, hit B. Left trigger. The left button. Great. Best button to have this map to. Can I go any higher? I can. Keep, keep warming. Which is weird, because I don't think this is how body heat works exactly. See, the thing... I'm going to go all scientists on this. If you're losing heat to the environment, how exactly do you get heat back? Or I guess you kept, your body's doing chemical stuff, I guess. I guess that makes sense. Your body is turning whatever chemical energy it's got into heat. Oh crap, I gotta do battles. Do I freeze? Well, we'll give him the good all. He's got the gun, right? Uh, Tifa, you hit this guy. Toxic buff! <laughs> How toxic is that buff? Apparently, not toxic enough to kill me. Well, enough to do decent damage. Too bad I can crit him. So, Barrett's got a gun. I'm sorry, I was a little bit like, what is going on last time? Toxic buff! Bleh. Oh, maybe Cloud can resist poison because of something. It ain't too bad, but... Yeah. Anyway, so, uh... I'm recording this on the 15th, so it's probably another week in advance to when I'm uploading it, but, uh... Uh... This past week, well, I guess we should always talk about what I've been playing for the past week. Um, 
I've been playing a lot of uh, Monster Hunter. I, it only came out yesterday when I recorded this. Mies. Uh, and I think I've clocked like five hours. Basically, I've really just kind of tried out with a lot of the weapons because I didn't really get into Monster Hunter when I played three. But this one, I'm really liking it. There's a lot of uh, tutorial esque kind of things. I don't want to say it's like, oh, it's a huge learning thing, but there's definitely one of the biggest problems a lot of people say about Monster Hunter is that it's a hard game to get into. So I was like, you know, the fact that they are giving a lot of um, advice on how to learn the weapons, I guess you just hold up when you go up here, how to, how to learn the weapons, what what's the best strategies, are there any like nice, nice combos to use, I like that in the tutorial. I also like how they kind of lead you into... Um, well, also with the tutorial, they give you just like a free environment, not really too many like hazards, and only one enemy that's pretty easy. You know, you know he's got a bit of health, but yeah, like he's not too bad, and I like that. So now I'm in the cave. Oh, of course, more battles. Should really heal Barrett, shouldn't I? Especially when we go into the exact same fight as before. Toxic bar. Oh gosh, that, that guy really hurt my throat. Eh. Oh, is that a crit? Is he back row? No, he's not. Yeah. Oh, meat. Does that mean it doesn't hit? Or at least it doesn't do the second attack. I don't know. I guess it doesn't do the second attack. Oh, I think Barrett's covering, that's why. His beard isn't poisoned. Let me get rid of that thing. Uh... as well. So, yeah, so, um... What else have we been playing? I also bought a Majora's Mask. Uh, but I haven't played it. Did I already do the cure? Oh, I guess it's just gonna get the limit break back. He dead, like so dead. There we go. Um, so yeah, I ha I haven't played Majora's Mask. I I've I uh bought it on Virtual Console like when it came back uh, when it came out on the Wii, but I didn't um really get into it too much, mainly because I um I found it way too hard. Not in terms of like, oh, the temples are hard, but it's more so figuring out how to get there. This, it's really cryptic. And it's weird, because I've also watched, um, Chucky Conroy play it. And also Nintendo Capri Sun, and I have still no clue how to play the game. How to beat it. I saw an item. I was, is this how you get it? Probably. Can I get that? There we go. It's in the box. Javelin. I don't know what the javelin is. So, yeah. Javelin. Probably a spear for, uh... Hang on, guy. Sid. Ah! So, yeah. But I feel like I would enjoy Major Majora's Mask. A lot of people have said that, yes, it is a also. Is this a big guy? Magic breath! What is he doing to Barrett? Uh, one, why did that heal everyone else for 2,000? Two, why did that heal everyone else for 2,000? That was not fair. Now we gotta get our freaking Phoenix down for Barrett. And then I gotta heal him right away. Also, if he kills Barrett right away. Oh, nice. Okay, so what that enemy has a really strong attack that kind of killed one guy, but didn't kill the other two I'm not sure why and then died really quickly. I Don't get this at all uh -huh. da -da. One, two, da -da. Uh, What's in here? Yeah, sure. I think I need to do that anyway. I didn't 
pop out the other side, which kind of scared me. I was like, what? You, I can see you ground over in the bottom right. <laughs> I noticed that. I was like, what? They're cheating. It's all one map. <laughs> okay. Um, so yeah. Other than that, I, uh... I was going to pick up the, uh, Humble Star Wars bundle, but... Ultrasound. It's beyond sound, and apparently mutes me. Which is a little bit jerkish doing that on my healer. But at least I don't have much health. Um, yeah. So, Humble Star Wars bundle. Uh, I was also going to pick up the, uh, books bundle that they've got going on, because there's actually some nice stuff in that. But of course, as when I'm saying this, that's going to be have, have passed. So, Vampire Fang. Okay. Not sure what that does. I'm guessing this goes around. What's the point of the rock? Because I'm past the point where the rock was. Okay. Ah! Back to Yeah, just change, change formation because... Give me the good old one, two, in the face. I feel like Barrett's just not doing as much attack as, uh, as a uh, Cloud Killer because I think, uh, Barrett's just low level. Reverse formation. Elemental level up. I'm getting a lot of material level ups. Maybe it's because I'm capitalizing on them more. Uh... Away we go. Okay, that's a, is that an exit? That down's an exit. Got it. Ah. Menu. Left button. It's gonna throw me off. Okay, uh, up we go. Oh, okay. I guess we'll go up because it looks like there's a flag right above us. Ah! Jeez. Um, anything else I played? Play this, man, bros. You know, the norm. Toxic bar! So a cloud can't be toxic. Or poisoned. Because he's probably just got something on him. Yeah, just keep going. Keep going, it'll work. Who are they cocked? Oh, they're doing Barrett again. Why always Barrett? I don't know if he can cover ranged attacks. Like magic. Maybe. Um. Thinking of other things I've done. Can't remember. Probably not. That's about it. Uh. Yeah, past week, mostly I've been editing that payday video that came out on Sun the week before, I guess, for you guys. Um. It hasn't actually come. It's coming out in like two and a half hours as I'm recording this, so. Haven't really got any feedback on it, but I hope that it's been good. Which would be a good sign. Oh, I guess this was the direction to go? Maybe there's goodies. Uh, go right. Go down. I was already there. I'm gonna... Do this. Cloud's getting a little bit blue in the face there. Seriously, look at him. He's like, ghostly white. Okay, up we go. Someone's gonna be yelling at me for missing stuff because I feel like this is missing things. I don't really know, like, if there are any, like, slide areas here, though. Not until you go into the caves. Why am I climbing a, ca a mountain anyway? Oh. There's a chest! Although it's probably gonna give me nothing considering how easy that looks to get. Toxic bath! You're on cloud, are you? Look at that, it worked! Double attack! I love. Wait, why do you counter that of all things? Counter it with a crit. Punch! So, yeah, uh. What happened in the past week? I, um. Oh, yeah, Evolve came out! Uh, in the past week as of recording this. Uh, 
exp video games are getting expensive. 1400 and he didn't die. He's probably got 1500. Um, video games are getting expensive. Like, I know, like, yes, they are getting expensive to make, and I feel like definitely if companies want to... I'm gonna give my two cents about this. Uh, if companies want to basically make more money, they're gonna have to start charging more, because I don't think uh, people... I don't really think they can get more numbers out of people buying games anymore. So they have to just kind of make more money places. DLC! Everyone is like, yeah, DLC is Spawn of Satan and all that stuff, but really, how bad is DLC? I think the problem with DLC is just that the game feels like it's... Uh, it doesn't have all the content uh, available in it. Like, it feels shrunk down. And honestly, I feel like that's the problem, is that the developers think that by making the game a bit smaller and then using the DLC to f finish it, which in the future, yeah, you will you will have a foolish game, but at the moment, you don't. And that's what a lot of people are complaining about. They are noticing that you are just trying to... How do I get up there? Is there a slope? You may never know. Um, yeah, I feel like, yeah, a lot of people have noticed that you can't release products like this. Uh, publishers. And I know that's the problem, is that... Is that, uh... Missed. Uh, yeah, the problem is people are noticing that your games are not as full. And they're feeling like, yeah, older games are so much better. Not because they're old, but because back then they didn't really feel like they needed to keep selling you bits of the game after you bought it. I understand that. Which would you rather? The fact that the smaller payments or the fact that it's all up front? That's what a lot of people are complaining about Evolve, is that you can get all of it up front, or at least almost all the skins. I don't know why, they, they're not even op offering an option to get all the skins at once. Okay, so, uh, for those who don't know, Evolve came out, that's a game by, uh, X Left 4 Dead guys. Because I don't know, they're making a Left 4 Dead 3, so why aren't they working on that? Um... Okay, uh... And, uh, yeah, a lot of people complained because it was like, it's a, it's a nice little game, but it's full price. It's like, it, in, on the Steam store, it's $80 US for us. In Australia, we have to play, we have to pay US prices, which is a bit of a problem because currently the Aussie dollar is going for like a dollar, sorry, currently the US dollar is a hun, is $1.30 for us. So that means that that, um, that $80 game is over 100 for us. And that doesn't matter too much, because it's like, yeah, sure, okay. But, again, you can also buy it in the store for $90. So it's like, okay, we'll just buy it in a store. Well, as long as they want, aren't doing digital deluxe versions, as they say. One, you can't buy the season pass in advance, unless you buy it online. So that's an additional $35. And on top of that, they've got this thing called the PC Monster Race version, which is 135 US on the Steam store. 135 US. That is 175 Australian dollars. On the contrary, for um, Monster Hunter, that came out $60, and that's going to have free add-on content. And I feel like the game is pretty also, wow. I feel like the game probably has enough content. Oh my gosh, jeez. That's why I think, I think Barrett needs the thing out, because it's like, if one person were to die on my team, Barrett's probably the one. Barrett's not the tank, though, that's the thing. Cloud's the tank. But I would rather have Cloud do all the damage. I should probably heal before another battle comes up out of nowhere. Uh... There goes all the teachers' stuff. I, I'm not using the old material, I'm sorry. Uh... So, yeah. So, 175 US! Or, 175 Australian, it's not 175 US. Oh, I'm on the left! Fire armor. Okay. Um, yeah. And I bought Monster Hunter for s What? Why is there a big... Icicle? Okay. Um, yeah. Now, okay. I wouldn't complain too much about this. Purely because I feel like... 2K did the exact same thing with Borderlands. Borderlands 2. It came out at launch, 
eighty dollars. It had um the whole skin system, and it had like the whole pre-order season pass. I don't think it had a special, like a super special version. Now the reason why I don't think people are complaining about or people weren't complaining about Borderlands as much is because Borderlands is a bit of a fuller game. It does take a lot of time to finish Borderlands. I still think that there's a lot of problems with that game, the second game. What happens if I big shot that icicle? I was wondering that because I can select that. Why? So the icicle doesn't actually attack you, it's just a uh, counters. Yeah, coffee. Why are these bats taking so long to die this time? Somersault. Probably would have died from the first hit. Um <laughs> I gotta fight that. Hold on. Uh help defend! What's the weight? I'm gonna just defend. <laughs> this guy isn't gonna attack. So I'm just gonna sense that thing. Let's go level 3. 3,000 weak against fire. Thank you very much. Wait. Crap. Uh. Magic. So that means I gotta wait until Barrett can do it. And Cloud's gonna pass him, isn't he? On oh, Barrett's. Ugh. So it's, yeah, it hits you in retaliation. It's a random person in retaliation. That's even worse. Once you counter it, is it dead? I'm worried. Oh, okay. Vampire thing. Uh, oh, so that was an actual like boss fight, so to speak. So I've got to do this four times. Okay. Oh crap, I attacked the thing before I pretty I'm gonna use the cure too because I'm lazy. Blade beam! Watching! So yeah. Uh so pricing, yeah. I, th I think Borderlands 2 was a bit of a kind of the same thing, but I guess people thought it was okay purely because it did have a lot of content on the disc. Or on, on, the, on the game, I don't know if people buy That only did 800? Okay. There are noises across the street. I don't know what's going on there. I don't know what those noises are. Probably a dog. Why am I missing so much? That is a dog, and it's noisy as that dog down the street. Why are these bats such a problem now all of a sudden? I can't hit them! That's the problem! I don't know why, I didn't have a problem with them before. Is that is one of them dead? Yes! Use the freaking big shot to get another one. Um. It missed! Oh my goodness. Too dead. I just got hit the third one. Oh gosh. Freaking Barrett. Doesn't even have a, like a bad percentage. It's just... How come they can attack it? Okay. Uh. Actually, you know what I'm gonna do. There's a reason why I'm getting all these high potions. Maybe I should use one. Yeah, coffee! That should take it out, because I already used the blade beam on it. Did I? What's that? Yeah. Summer salt. There we go. So there's no point in me doing anything other than waiting for this animation. Okay. So I can, like, go back and... I feel like maybe there's a reward thing. So if you jump down to the room below, you 
get this re reward, but I feel like that chest one has a really good reward. That's why it keeps asking me every time. It's the restraint that gets you what you need. Wow, I'm running low on the MP. Alright. Ah, two more. So yeah. Point is, $175 for a game that doesn't even come with all the content that they're going to have on it. It comes with the season pass, yeah, and it comes with all the fancy gameplay features that they're adding. But it doesn't come with everything. That's the thing. They're doing so much like random exclusive stuff, I think. A lot of people were like, there's so many different bundles that they needed to make a chart. And they made a chart and it's just like, yeah, why why are we why did you make a chart? Why did you need to make a chart? People said that there was some simplicity in just like buying a game and oh there's four of them, that's why. Uh there's a simplicity in just buying a game and booting it up and all that stuff. Now we gotta deal with like patches nowadays, which granted day one patches, I don't mind too much. I just wish that like maybe games should tell you beforehand. Like, for example, if you're going to buy a game on disc, like, that's the biggest problem with patches. If you download it, it's fine, because it comes with the patches already on it. But if you're buying the game uh, on a disc, and you need to download patches, they should make it so that if you're, like, if you're going to get the game, it should download the patches for you, and then just do the whole installation afterwards. That's not gonna kill it. Big shot. Plenty of damage, but not enough to kill it. Did that kill it? Nah. Barracks might. Yes, definitely. That's enough. Yeah. Um. So, yeah. Uh. Anything else in the news? Um, not really anything. That some weird weather outside. I'm just looking at it like, oh, jeez. Great zoom in, guys. Also, 3,100 experience every time I'm doing this. Well, not every time. It was a little bit different depending on how many bats there were. But this ice core is doing a lot of, a lot of experience, which is always good. Cause how does level 38? Man, my estimate of like beating the game at level 50 or level 30, way off. But, I don't know, do you go up to like 50 or something? Probably. Alright. Last one, how many bats are there? Four. Four bats. Yeah, coffee! See, the thing is, she missed the first one. I'm okay with her hitting it again. Although that didn't kill it. And it's probably gonna suck all the health back, which is a bit of a problem. Because I have no clue which one she did attack, because I can't target it. So I'm just gonna keep going in whatever order it's aiming in. There we go. That was one, yeah. And this is the last one, so give it some good old hits. I should actually have this over real quickly. Does Barret have to. I attacked it tonight. Yeah. No, Barret's got the fire magic. No, Bolt doesn't fire. I can't. That's a, that's a jerk move. But granted, at least you can do a lot of damage anyway. Like seriously, I just did a thousand damage, and Cloud is probably in the, in the fury right now. Blade beam. Coaching. That should kill, yeah. Um, so yeah, so, yeah, developers, or, I don't know if it's developers or the publishers doing this, a lot of people are a little bit like, I don't, I don't know, no one, I don't think anyone's complained about being offered the season path before the game is out. I don't think anyone complains about that, because I think it's something we all expect. A lot of games are coming out with season passes, mainly because they want to get you to buy it, uh, no, why would I jump down to the room below when I can grab this mega elixir? Was that worth it? To get that mega elixir? Because now I can't jump down to the room below. Can't I? Oh, I can. Alright. 
Right. Right, accidentally hit no. There we go, yes. Ah, so now I'm back in this room. Well, I guess I'll end it off here, because I think I did my rant already. That's what it was. The fourth one did that high thing off there. How about we check... We grab that item, and we'll figure out what to do. So I think he needed the second one, maybe, to proceed on. And the fourth one only get, gives that random item there. Kill the bats. Get it over with. Um... So, yeah. so I don't think anyone has a problem with being off at the season pass initially. I just think people have a problem when it goes to the extreme. I don't think anyone would want to pay more than the price of the game that they bought. Like, I wouldn't... yeah. For the... for the... Evolve... PC Monster Race, $175 is almost as much as how much it costs at EB Games. Speed... oh, uh, sorry, almost twice as much. Speed Source, okay. Well, that'll be... Yeah, that'll be interesting, I'll figure it out next time. Anyway, uh, enough about ra ranting about, a uh, freaking Evolve. A lot of people say it's a good game, but waiting on the price, I guess. Uh, so I guess with that, I'll see you guys next time on Final Fantasy VII Blind, where we'll see where does this hole lead to. See you kids then.